In this video, I'm going to show you how to use this monogramous font. Um, this is what it looks like, and this is actually how it types out if you're to use your capital letters. Um, but if I go to my text and I type in lowercase letters, um, this is actually what you want, okay? The other one has, well, let me just show you. Um, capital letters give you a white letter with a black background, and you can't separate those in Design Space. You need the black letters, okay? So just remember when you use this in Design Space that you use the black um, lowercase letters with no background, okay? So then what you're going to want to do is select it and ungroup it first. And as you can see, it's still got three, and you can't ungroup it, you can't unweld it or unattach it or anything. So you, what you have to do is slice. So let's go ahead and grab a square. <clears throat> and I'll duplicate that a couple of times. And I'm going to cover everything but my first letter that I need. And then I'm going to select those two, and I'm going to slice. All right, so then I have my R. I can select these two and delete them. And then I need the middle M. So I'm going to select those two and I'm going to slice. <clears throat> and I'll delete this one and delete this one. And then I need to slice the other side. I'll just use the same square. Slice that. And there's my M, okay? And then, oops. And then I need the last C, the one on the right. I'll select those and I'll select. <clears throat> okay, so there it is. It's that easy. Um, I'm going to group this and enlarge it. Now, when I did this earlier, I had holes in here. Um, I don't know why, but I did. So if that happens to you, you can either fix it in Inkscape or um, try to slice it and then weld your letter with um, the letter that it sliced because it will slice out those little pieces and um, Maybe that will fix it. I was hoping it would do it again, but it didn't. So I'm not positive that will work, but it should. So what I'm saying is um, take a shape and slice the letter that is um, that has the holes, okay? Um, let me go ahead and move these two out of the way. So I'll slice these two. And then... Sorry about that. I had them grouped. I didn't even notice. I was like, what happened? <laughs> okay. So let me arrange my square to the front. All right. Now we'll select them and we'll slice. So then what you would want to do is select these both and well. Okay. And hopefully that will fill in any holes if you do have them. Um, if it doesn't, then you'll need to probably take it to Inkscape and do it there, okay? So that's how you use the monogramma spot. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.